Welcome to Unbiased and On the Fence. I'm Shane. Thank you so much for joining. Well, you'll hear me often talk about Mr. MBB333. Dot com, the website, and of course, Mr. MBB333's YouTube channel, uh, because he keeps up on a lot of information. I wanted to play a clip from his uh, latest uh, Watchers report, because uh, I've got some images that sort of back up uh, what he presented in that uh, report. Um, now, of course, here's uh, Mr. MBB333.com. It's got a lot of great resources, real-time information that you can click on this is actually where i get my schumann resonance there's the dust making its way across the atlantic into the caribbean the gulf of mexico up into south texas through uh, south padre island we're going to look at from a webcam's perspective here in just a few minutes into the east pacific and i'm getting reports from san diego they're saying they're seeing sands of the sahara making the rounds up the west coast and that's really what this was all about, because he was talking about the sands of the Sahara. And you can see here on the Null School uh, website, you can see the particles covering pretty much the whole world. And this was taken from Tulsa International Airport yesterday. And you can see sort of the dingy blue. But as we look towards the sun, look at the Sahara all the way here in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Is this not amazing? It's almost like we have our yellow sun back, in a way. Uh, it's kind of nostalgic. I actually took some images and I t uh, toned down the brightness so you can actually see the sun's really much smaller. And then, uh, of course, this is the Tulsa skyline. But look at this, the dingy, tan-colored. Uh, it almost looks like smog, but this is not usual. This is actually, we're looking at the sands of the Sahara all the way across the Atlantic Ocean, up through the Gulf, up through Texas, and in here to Oklahoma. It's amazing. Now today officially marks the day that all of the planets in the solar system are on one half of the sun. And it will be that way for the next 53 days. Now this is the image from our last broadcast with Michelle Wolf when she was explaining stuff. And you can actually see how Mars is uh, really close to Earth at this point. So if you've seen the star in the sky that's reddish, that's actually Mars you're seeing. And it's super bright right now, super close, and uh, great time. I've actually been waiting for these sands from the Sahara to clear up a little bit so I can actually get my telescope out and get some information or get some uh, images of that. Now, here's some information from Candace Crawl goldman She sent me, uh, if you missed that on the quantum healing uh, course, that uh, the price has been reduced to 333 but on top of that if you enter the code when you click this link here to enroll you can actually click this code code she sent me and it will give you an additional 10 percent off so you can use a uotf10 and uh, you don't have to miss out on the discount and because uh, i know a lot of people were wanting to take part in that but didn't have a lot of time to uh, actually come up with the funds. And like I was saying during that broadcast, you can sort of think outside the box, maybe find some sponsors because I know money's tight with a lot of people. But if you find maybe a handful of people that you can give a discounted session to, they might uh, be willing to sponsor the money for you. And then, uh, you know, you can take the course. I did it in about a week, but I was pretty aggressive with it because I was really hungry to, to, to learn how it works. And so I spent a lot of time on it. But, you know, two weeks, you could easily be through it. And, uh, and yeah, start doing uh, sessions right away. So it was really fun. It's, the con it's really content rich. We've got a lot of videos, got a lot of resources. And uh, I'm sure some people who took part in it can chime in below at how you feel about the course up to this point. I thought it was a, a, a great course with a uh, really professional and, uh, and it really has everything you need to get started. Plus, if you've already got some healing modalities and things that you use, you can incorporate that in with it. And uh, it really makes for uh, a nice tool to add to your toolbox. Nice resource. So it is a little bit of an investment, but, you know, it is something that you're adding to what you can do. And I think it can help a lot of people. So uh, that's really all I have for you. Now, of course, we have the Friday night call-in show. We have the Saturday night. Power of 8 at 8, that's 8 p.m. Eastern time. 
And then, of course, uh, this coming Monday, we're going to have on Magenta Pixie. Really excited about that. So a lot coming down, and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow for the call-in show. Lots of love and light to each and every one of you. See you in the next one. Have a good one.